啦啦。Hello, peeps, and welcome back to Two Point Hospital. Welcome back to Rockford Castle, where we would like to take on this fracture emergency. So we're going to need a fracture ward.、Um, I don't know if we'll be keeping the fracture ward, but we're definitely going to give this a whirl.、Uh, treatment. Let's see here.、Um, so let's build our fracture ward. We're going to build.、Um, I think.、Um, Uh, a fairly small one.、Uh, we might. It's a little bit of an odd. <laughs> Don't know.、Uh, it's just it's these traction beds, right? They're really really big. So,、um, we'll pop one, I think, here. Will one go? Right. Will look. Go opposite. And then we can have another one over here. But then, where's the door going to go? <laughs> Nobody knows, Tiddly Pom. Let's、uh, pop this traction bed. I don't want it right next to the window. Maybe if we put that there. No, it won't. Right. Okay. So then we could pop the desk、um, here. Maybe. This is very weird, fracture ward. This is what happens when you're trying to build something、uh, quickly, just to make something. Function for a moment, so we might、uh, do that because, like I say, I don't think we're going to keep it. So let's pause this a minute. We're going to need a nurse.、Uh, terribly dull. Oh my goodness, it's not going to be you though, is it? Unhygienic. Has <sighs> one bit of ward training. What we'll do, I think, we'll just close this a minute, and we will try and find a better nurse. I think, because、um, you're not going to be any good. No. Well, we'll wait a little bit on that one. I think. So, how is everything going at the moment in in this hospital? So we're still level four, which means we can、uh, probably ooh, keep things a little bit under control.、Um, the janitors. Well, we have, we do have two, but I suppose there's no harm in getting another one in. Let's see here. So you are to do machines. Okay. There we go. Maybe something like that. Might be good.、Um, and so, how how did we Hester? How did we right? Fair enough. So you can just keep、uh, the gear you've got on. Announcement: It's happening again. It's happening again. But you, I think, needs high vis, don't you, Kim? Let's have a look. Kim was a yeah. Tony Satsuma. Yeah, that was pretty impressive, to be honest. <laughs> okay, there we go. They've sorted that out. So that's twenty ghosts. Oh look, here's the helicopters in. Oh, oh no. Oh, we failed to cure ten patients. I didn't see the warning. Oh no, I didn't see the warning.、Uh, we should probably put some fire extinguishers about. <laughs> Maybe that would be a good idea. <laughs> uh, let's put one here. Actually, would it fit between the door and the? No. Yeah, I'll leave it there then.、Uh, we should probably. Uh, pop one in here, right where the fire would be. Yeah. <laughs> Let's pull that out. Where else? Where else? Oh, in here. There we go. Excellent. Lovely. Are you all okay? Are you? What is this now? Open message. Earn a hundred thousand. I don't think that's possible right now. Um. Saw judgment. 
It's treated in the ward. Okay. Now, do we have... Ooh. Litter up. That's okay. They do have a bit of ward training. So what we might do is stick him... Uh, oops. In the fracture ward. Excellent. Let's open this up. Open. Okay. How many people is it? Five. Should be okay. I don't know if we're going to be able to do this, quite honestly. But, um, do you know, we'll, gi we'll give it a go. <laughs> we'll give it a jolly good try. <laughs> uh, where's my notice board? I can't cope without the notice board. Nurse to injection room. Okay, now where is he? Are you going to leave now? Well... Okay. Okay. Where? Are they going to come this way or that way? Here we go. This must be them, right? Yes. Look at that. Okay. So, new illness discovered. So, they've got dead arm. They have dead arm. Cure chance 75%. That's not too bad. They've got dead arm. Why are they limping? And what's wrong with his head? Just saying. Look, they're very important peeps. Very important peeps. It will get them to their destination faster if they're all uh, running around like this. Are you not a, a ghosty? No, not a ghosty. Okay. So here they are. They have arrived. <laughs> so he's getting the three in. Oh. And what we might do is pop this up and have her help. She could help, right? There we go. Get two of them on it. So we've got, because we've got five, so another two out here. Excellent. Should we, so we can see the progress. Anywhere in the hospital will not be tolerated. It will not be tolerated. Okay. And it might be that we can make these three work between these two different departments. Okay, they're working on it. Oh, is that one coming out? <gasps> Did you... Are you going to be cured? When do they start walking in? Oh my god, I hope we successfully treated them. I don't this machine. It's scary, isn't it? Oh, he's looking alright. Yes! There's one! Okay, okay. Let's get the others in. Should we get the others in? Surely they're ready to come in now. Is he going to be treated? Yes, he reminds me of Smarty, that guy. He looks a lot like Mark Smart. <laughs> okay. Cut. So, another one's come in. We are missing one. Nice beanie. Yes! <gasps> this is going well! And here's the last two. Oh my goodness. This is fantastic. We're doing really well with this. I'm pleased we took this on. Please we took this off. <laughs> we need to cure 150 patients. I mean, we could get a marketing department in and all the rest of it. But uh, we're a very new small hospital. And I, I don't want to take on more than we can cope with at the moment. I know it's going well, but that can be deceiving. Um, yeah, we can. Shall we upgrade it again? Let's give that another upgrade. What? That's why you need Jumbo Security Systems. 
we'll fill your house with cameras. Watch your every move. Time is running out. We're never going to do this, are we? We are that. <laughs> it's good to know where we are, though. Jumbo. We spy because we care. I mean, even if we kill all of these and get our bonus money, we're still not even going to get close to that. So we might keep this fracture ward. Um, I don't know if we'll get any more people in, though, with fracture problems, will we? Oh, look at this. This is one of the new illnesses for this. Uh, this is the reanimation um, illness for this level that they've started to come in. Isn't that amazing? And I think we've already unlocked it. It unlocked, didn't it? I think. So he'll want this room here. So this is the new room for Rockfall Castle, and this is the illness that goes with it. <laughs> it's amazing. Oh, oh, oh! Henry Jobsworth's been in. It says it's an incredible, incredibly mediocre hospital, but that's fine. I can cope with that. Um, so I think we failed that staff challenge. Yeah. But I think we're going to pass a flying colours on these fracture patients. Oh, check out the trousers. Do you think... Oh, yeah. This would be... Um, I'd enjoy this customization of, of clothing. You know? I mean, sure, some might say, what's the point of being able to customise patients' clothes? They're just... They're only in there for a second and they leave again. Well, I still like the idea of putting a Blala t-shirt on them. All right. Um, or, you know stuff make up our own uniforms you know <laughs> why hell no <laughs> oh hello so he's getting a little bit busy <laughs> he's getting a little bit busy we should probably help him out so let's um oh view these <laughs> let's view these open all uh who's our rising star Spencer. Is he the one that we trained on? He might have been. So what we'll do, we're, we're going to pause this moment because I could copy this room, but I'd like to do it on the opposite, I think. So that's what we are going to do. Um, I'm going to build this on the opposite. And then we can start copying them. Let's do this. Um, there we go. Um, now, uh, <laughs> I'll work this out in a minute. Pop these here, pop that there. Okay, it's going pretty well. And pop that in there like that. Oh, I'm going to need this. Excellent. Pop that behind him. Um, I do like a cupboard and you know what we'll give them a different rug yeah um i mean he's got a globe he might get jealous <laughs> that'll do so now uh we don't have nasty wow okay so it might need to be Miles here, who becomes our other GP. Um, let's remove these to make sure that they stay in the GP offices. There we go. And then um, let's get some Bennies here. Um, and... What is the temperature like just here? It's all right. Okay. Excellent. Put out that fire. We're dealing with the ghosts quite no nicely. Rantlers. Um, injection room again. So we might need to... This is fantastic. So pleased with that. We might need to consider um, a second injection room at this rate. We're getting a lot of illnesses coming into the injection room. Um, and possibly um, maybe... Ooh. Interesting. We're just keeping on it. We're keeping on it. We're upgrading the machine, which is great. But yeah, we need to keep an eye on that one, I think. 
Um, cardiology is okay. Um, we could really do with improving uh, their GP training. It'd be nice, wouldn't it, actually, to get some doctors that we could just gear up for this sort of stuff, you know. Get some that are, are geared up for now. Do we have any nurses working in this room? Uh, yeah, Mia, who's uh, having a break, that's fine. Because I don't think there's a massive queue here or anything. No, just Tarquin. <laughs> Excellent. Um, yeah, it's it's really not that bad at all. That's absolutely fine. So uh, we could do with upgrading uh, the Heart Racer as well. That will be... A good task uh, to be doing now we said didn't we with these nurses what might be nice is sharing their duties it's particularly good as well because these are right next door to each other you know they are right next door to each other which is always always nice um, I'd like to pop that in there because I, I love that Bins will become full. Um, and Prem's illusion rug. I particularly like. <laughs> uh, there we go. <laughs> it's available on the Steam Workshop. <laughs> the illusion rug uh, by Prem de la Creme. Yeah. Actually, I, I'm not entirely sure what his name is on Steam. It's, I'm pretty sure it's still Prem. Ah. Uh, he, he made the pug. The pug Toilet picture that I love. <laughs> right. So, what's going on here? Um, oh, yeah. So, the reanimation. Oh, ghosts. <laughs> Still trying to diagnose them. The ward is actually looking quite busy, isn't it? So, maybe we could see about having three wards and three nurses. Maybe we could put this. Maybe we could make a strum. Um, with this ward only. Um, because I'm thinking we might need to separate diagnosis and treatment. My latest hobby is really connecting me with my more creative side. I'm learning to be a tattoo artist. Oh, yeah. You know how you can get cheap haircuts from students at barber school? Well, you can get real cheap tattoos from me. Just don't ask for anything too complicated. My speciality is small black dots. So I might pop that over there. So that we can copy. We're sorry for the litter that you dropped on our So we can copy this. And then we might make this one treatment. This one diagnosis. There we go. And we will uh, probably just, um, and we'll see which gets busy because I've got a feeling this is not going to get terribly busy. This one here, um, but one of these is probably going to get busy. It might be the diagnostic one. Stop sweeping that up. Get rid of the ghost. It's driving people gaga. So yeah, it might be. So this is the diagnosis, right? So we might put the extra nurse on here. And then they can take on the treatment, you know? So we might send you, let's clear this out a little bit. I'm thinking we might send them for treatment 69, 71. So we might kill them, but I do like the idea of just trying to get some out of this queue. Let's move you to the top. There we go. <clears throat> Just help this a little bit. Send them to the injection. Which has a queue building because it's being upgraded. But we're about there with that upgrade look. We are about there. 
So it's not too bad. Should we get some more bennies? In here. There we go. Who knew this was going to be ward heavy? I didn't. Um, boneless thighs. Fracture ward. Ah, oh, excellent. Something for the fracture ward. Paranoids. Ooh. A psychiatry one. Um, interesting. Do we have any doctors with psychiatry? Or mm. well, we could just train up David Peach here. Should we do that? Maybe we could get David Peach to be a psychiatrist and we'll get uh, Herman Froud <laughs> uh, in to do it. So, <clears throat> now let's see here. Um... Yeah, we don't really have. Could do with unlocking some more, couldn't I? Shall we unlock this one? And we might put him in the orange, yeah. Okay. Um, excellent. And then we will knock away all this. Now, while he's getting his training... Oh, they're actually not going to... They're going to have to go. But psychiatry... Right, okay. So, <clears throat> psychiatry. We might pop that. Uh, oh, we will just pop it here. Let's pop that here. Um, and you know what? They're going to be doing both diagnostic. treatment all oh, the ghosts are back everybody all oh, the ghosts are back Attention. Don't feed the ghosts. They're dead. Um, I'm wondering if we should put this in instead um, it's much warmer it is much warmer so it might <laughs> uh oh Well that's not good. Nurse wanted on the ward. Uh okay. <laughs> I'm struggling with this. I'm struggling with it. Um Right. I have not put a window in or anything. This is a disaster. <laughs> this is a disaster zone. Um Let's get him his hot chocolate at least. There we go. And his sweet dispenser. Just get the basics in there. Um, so what is it like for temperature in here? Yeah, that's all right. Excellent. That that will do, huh? That will do. Um, what is this one? This is the ward. Okay, doghouse required. Just send him home. Uh, I'm still working on this one, to be quite honest. Um, I can only do one thing at a time. So we'll do this. And I've done this badly. Um, and I've not made my room look nice at all. It needs a rug. Doesn't it? it needs a rug, doesn't it? I can't continue until it has a rug. Um, we'll give it the classic, I think. Um, I feel as though a globe would be nice. <laughs> um, <clears throat> oh, yeah. Definitely. Um... Okay. Will that go? Yeah. I mean, that, that'll that be alright, won't it? That will be okay. So, we do still have a situation with the GPs, don't we? He's got a bit of GP training. But what we really need to do is... Um, is start finding some doctors, seriously, to train up specifically in GPs, I think. Surgery, no. Um, <clears throat> so we've got our psychiatrist. Um, but yeah, before we continue to expand the hospital and adding dog houses and, and stuff like that, or even the... Oh no, we should probably add the reanimation though, given that this whole level is about it. Um, I think before we expand too far, we really need to start training up these staff. And I, I want to find the, 
the right staff to train. Um, but four by four. This next song is for all the hospital patients shaken up by that earthquake. This is a three by three zone. Organs are still in the right place. Uh, it's quite a big room. It's quite a big room. So to do this, we might have to buy something else. Um, uh, yeah, stop editing this. So how much is this? Ten. Okay, so we might need to build it in here for now. Is that is that big enough? Yes. Okay. <laughs> Look at it. It's craziness. The doctor goes round the back to operate. Okay, so maybe... something like this okay now what's nice about this is that it has um, extra items look at all these I'm running out of kudos but I really want them we'll have to save up look at this bottled electricity not sure how this is accomplished so there's that <laughs> wall torch should not be removed and walked around with and then we also have the plasma ball when I touched it it made me feel funny so we've got the um, the cryomatic cold water to cure a big claw to retrieve. <laughs> um, so I think we will um, pop a few of these around. This is a this is a little bit cheaper to unlock and uh, get around the place. So we'll do that. So we'll put those in. But um, yeah, we might have to save a little bit for these and. Um, now, if we do that, look at this. Isn't this great? Look at this. Now, I believe they let off a little bit of heat, but it's tiny. Oh, they've actually done a pretty good job. It's got a bit warm over there. Excellent. Okay. Um, so, I feel as though we do need a fire extinguisher, to be honest. Um, and then, uh, items. Let's get the items for this room. Um, so the doctor will be back here. So I might pop that there. And um, the chair. There. Uh, oops. I got a bit click heavy there. Okay. And so he's got drink and somewhere to sit. Hygiene, but a little bit of food. Snackage, there we go. Now, this reanimation room uh, requires a doctor. Okay. Requires a doctor. Now, we'll get this geneticist, even though they have no treatment training at all. So, this probably isn't going to go terribly well. 40% treatment probably not going to go terribly well and he's going to become look our treatment doctor so it's a little bit weird it's a little bit weird so yeah this is what I mean is that I think we do really need to start finding staff that are, are geared towards specific departments and then we need to start training them up so I think that's that's the next step here before we allow the hospital to expand and grow too fast and then the wheels just will come off. So I think that uh, we'll have to keep it this size just for a little bit while we find some decent staff and uh, get training them. Yeah. Thank you for watching, I hope you've enjoyed the episode, if you did please hit that like button. As long as you are here, why not take your first step on the path to total coolness by supporting me via Patreon. The cooler you are, the harder I work, which means even more shizwa.